All right, last Apple story of the day. Here we go. YouTuber creates world's first Apple Silicon iMac. This is the one we told you to hold out for. You could just buy it from this guy, actually. Oh. Uh, no, you can't. It's a DIY type situation. His name, Luke Miani. And what he did is he took an iMac shell and actually built uh, a Mac Mini inside of it. So oh. he removed the shell of the Mac Mini. He jammed it inside of an iMac structure, which it was that iMac was already messed up to begin with. It had issues. He then used an adapter to get the iMac to basically behave as a display. And essentially what you end up with is, well, it's an M1 iMac, sort of. But really it's just an i, It's just a Mac Mini with an iMac as a monitor. You know what I'm saying here, Will? Okay, yeah. I'm following along. But it's a cool little project anyhow, anyway. And the end results are, I mean, I like the end results. All of a sudden you got the the M1 benefits. Now I'm just realizing things like the SD card slot on the slot on the side there. That's not going to function. I guess he doesn't, he doesn't care. He doesn't need to use that. Uh, the USB ports on the back of the iMac. Did he map those accordingly? Let's see what, what actually the way he wired this up over here. Oh yeah, maybe it looks like it. Cool. Nice. Even the SD? Maybe. Anyway, point being is it's a cool little DIY getting some usefulness out of a pre-existing iMac stand structure and display that was sitting around, bringing it back to life by uh, baking a Mac Mini in there and not needing uh, a secondary, not needing another monitor mm -hmm. in that circumstance. And cool. the crazy part, which showcases the efficiency of the new M1 stuff, is he's got a way more powerful computer using a ton less space and a ton less power right. than the original iMac in which it actually replaced the internal. So shout out. Luke Miani, cool little project, sir.